is day 12 because it's freaking loud. <laughs> we are back in Roswell. We just did the drive from Athens to Roswell and our first stop back at home is North Point Mall. Yellow is better, right? Excited to come here to get a sports bra because I am doing my last sponsored brand ambassador post with them and one of the sports bras isn't going to come until after December 21st and the post is supposed to be going up on December 20th. So I have to come and get another sports bra but it's okay because this is like actually a better color than the one I bought. We are currently at Sugar Boo and Co. <laughs> my mall. This is like a new thing for me because I haven't been here in years. Well, probably not years but anyways. This place is so freaking cute. It's so like, what, what's this? Rustic? It's kind of like West Elm mixed with like it is not West Pottery Elm. Barn. The inside of it, it's basically, it's basically West Elm. That's all West Elm is. No, West Elm is like more modern. I'm not talking about the style, I'm talking about what the store is. Oh, okay. It's like furniture and like cute little knickknack things, but it's really cute. I want everything. Even that ugly ass Christmas tree behind you. It's me. I'm talking about that Christmas tree. Like in theory, it's very cute and um, rustic, bohemian, but like, what the fuck? <laughs> I need this chair in my life. I literally want it so bad, but I know it's gonna be like, stupid expensive. This mirror, I need it. I need this mirror so bad. I mean, that, it's not bad. And even this thing, maybe not the colors, but that's cool. Mm-hmm. And our favorite store. Ryan's current obsession is knives. Isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it's like shit knife. I don't want. <laughs> you should ask for Christmas. You don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I want one. What would you cook and make with a knife? Steaks and wings and hamburgers. <laughs> do hamburgers really need nice knives? You know, you cut it in half and then the egg is like Burly cook and the yolk falls over there. <laughs> I love coming into the store and just seeing these little cute like things. I don't know. I just want it all like I don't need to make ice cream, but like and even if I got this, will I make it? Probably not, but it's so cute. The only ice cream scooper this nice, but I want one. Ryan was just saying he wanted coffee from Starbucks and their latte looked it up with that free. Uh, espresso. Oh, that was cappuccino. And it was all like tiny mugs. So <laughs> yeah. Put some these. <laughs> We're at Kukuku right now, and today is buy a dozen, get a dozen for one dollar. So we're waiting in line and enjoying this wonderful view. Really? Satisfaction. Hey guys, happy Vlogmas Day 13. Today we're starting the day off at noon. We woke up kind of like pretty pretty decently early and <laughs> <laughs> but I had to get ready. Like I had to blow dry my hair, I got a shower, I did my makeup. Um, we're taking some photos just to, to have them because I like taking photos and I've been wanting to take like really nice ones with Ryan. Um, obviously we don't have a photographer pal so tripod day it is. Right now we just parked at Lita Thompson and they have these like, what's what's that kind of grass called? Like, it's just long grass. Yeah, just like long grass that's like photogenic, you know? Like the field kind of picture. So that's what mm, I think my vibe's gonna be for this little photo shoot. But I wanted to do one by a Christmas tree. So we might try to find one. I don't know, we'll see. Watch of the day, Apple Watch, series, original. 42 millimeter Nike Sport Loop band. Lovely. Should you do a watch of the day picture? What? Unless you're doing a watch of the day picture on Instagram. You should. Well, we have like five watches. <laughs> Babe, I need my SD card. Where is it? It's in the car. <laughs> Where in the car though? It's in my side, it's in the passenger side, it's the Amazon mall packages. Yeah. Really? And he saves the day. I'll take the 128. This is our location. This is Bay. I have a Canon 70D, 50 millimeter 1.2. Yep, that's it. We 
just wrapped shooting. I think the photos turned out really, really good and Ryan has definitely impressed me because he took so many good photos of me. <laughs> so we just got to the Avalon and we are two hangry people right now. We're trying to wait for Kona Girls happy hour. It starts at three, but it's like 2.20. I don't think we can make it, but. What'd you get? Got some sauce, you know, as an appetizer. What was that big gulp at all? Try it. Put it in the back of your tongue, trust me. Like, put, stick your tongue out almost and drink it. On the way home, we went to Target and I got a chocolate orange. These are so freaking good. Basically, it's just milk chocolate that has like an orange flavor. It kind of like sounds weird, but it's literally so addicting because it like milk chocolate is so freaking good. Anyways, comment down below if you've ever had like one of these Terry orange chocolate things. So, so yummy. So you're supposed to break it and like hit it against the table. Yummy, yummy. So I just got to my dad's house and fun fact, I've never really put anything in my closet in this room. So this is a very monumental moment. Wow, wow. That was about just right. <laughs> I have like so much space in this closet, which is amazing because when I actually do have like all my clothes in here, God bless, like, I don't know how I'm gonna like downgrade from this closet, so hopefully my first apartment, first house has something like this, but um, yeah, my room is a mess because I emptied out my car. I'm just gonna like store everything in here, even though like I'm at Ryan's all the time, but like whatever, I'll just store a lot of things in here. I'm just gonna put it here because literally the only good lighting is in my closet. It has like this bright ass light bulb like in there. It's like one little light bulb, but I have been trying to think of like a good Christmas present to ask for. Um, and I think I'm just gonna ask for like money to decorate my room. I was gonna tell everyone what I want for, from you for Christmas. Now tell me. It's not even now. <laughs> I told breaking you. Breaking news live on the vlog, tell me. <laughs> <laughs> I said that I want like just money to decorate my room. Or find some DIYs to make you too. Yeah, I want Ryan to make me a lot of DIYs because he's so good at that. I want, I want like a little wooden box for to put my feet on, like a little ottoman, and then what, is that what it's called, a little footrest or something? Mm -hmm. And then I don't know what else. I feel like maybe I should make a mood board for this room, just because like my room's navy What's blue. A mood, a mood board's like pictures and stuff that goes together, so you have like kind of like an idea of what you're doing. I definitely want like a plant in my room, like a white vase you know, fake plant kind of ordeal, but I want it to be like kind of big because I want it to go in one of these corners over here. Well, can't see that. Uh, Maybe over here or what? Oh yeah, that would look cute under the TV. So if you guys have been watching my Vlogmas, I got these stars at Target in the $1 section. They literally match my bed like perfectly. Isn't that insane? This is the situation we have right now. So yeah, gotta do some unpacking. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. Ryan just left and I am about to take my makeup off and get all cozy in bed. I'm freezing right now because I totally forgot to even turn the heat on down here. So I just did that, but I did want to um, answer someone's question that they just commented on my last video. And she basically asked like, how do you get into doing like food photography for restaurants and stuff like that? So basically for the restaurant I first did it at, I went there with my boyfriend and I love taking pictures of my food. And I was actually vlogging that day so I had this camera. 
um, so I just decided to take pictures of them. The lighting was so good, they turned out really, really great, so I decided to send them um, in, I think it was like their DMs of the Instagram account, or I might have like asked them for an email. I personally feel like it's better to ask for an email through like Instagram or something, or like even if they have a main email on their website, you can ask for like the social media manager's number, or email, that's what I meant. Um, and then that way you can kind of build a relationship with them. So basically I emailed them and I was like, hey, like here's some pictures I took if you want to use them on your Instagram. Like I asked them to tag my account, um, my photography account. I think it was actually my personal account at first, but anyways, now I like them to tag my photography account. Um, and that's pretty much how it got started. And then I think like two months or one month later, they asked me to come back and take photos and it was like so perfect because I was literally in Athens um, after Thanksgiving break for like two more days so we like did it really quick. And then when I came back for a December break, I went there again and then did another place too. Um, so the girl who I reached out to actually has two clients in the Athens area so I did both of her clients. So that is how that all got started. It's kind of like the same way with beauty influencers. Like if you want to be featured on their account, then you have to start using the product beforehand. Unfortunately, you can't just really get sent free things. I mean, sometimes you can, like that's great and all, but most of the time to get the brand to notice you, you kind of have to just like use their products already. So it's more organic because that's what brands want. So I'd like to think that's how it is with food photography. You go eat at the restaurant, take a couple of pictures, show them what you can do for them, and then like go from there. But like it doesn't always have to be like that. Obviously you can just go ahead and email them and be like, hey, I do food photography, here's what I've done, here's my portfolio. If you need any of my help with pictures, then reach out to me, and easy as that. But like I said, I'm gonna go get in bed, take off my makeup, and I'll see you guys in my next vlog. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.